What is up, Glovers? This is your boy, White Glover, and today I'm going to be reviewing a TV show. Not a movie, but a TV show that I've been binge watching all the time, and that is. Bob's Burgers. Alright. <clears throat> And you guys, uh, Bob's Burgers is one of my favorite TV shows of all time. It is kind of what you all have seen uh, in my bio of this channel, and um, and it's it's so cool. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and the Holiday Collection. Bob's Burgers is yes, guys, yeah, one of my favorite TV shows. I said before, um, this show is about. A Belcher family who lives in a restaurant uh, with the house above it, and then they the kids. Uh, so a lot of times the kids like kind of go out go they go outside the restaurant and they explore explore the city about what's gonna happen. How are we gonna solve this? Uh, um, how are we gonna solve this thing? And uh, it's just it's just really it's just a great show. And um, <laughs> one of my favorite characters. Uh, on that show is Tina and Linda. They're actually they're my two favorite characters because uh, Tina, she's smart, strong, and sensual. Uh, uh, I think she's my like, I think she might be my future girlfriend, guys. So, uh, but I already have a girlfriend, so yeah, so it's it's great. <laughs> and like Tina is just like uh, he, she like, she moans like almost every time in her episodes, like. I think actually every time she moans in uh, this show, on the show, so uh, it's really uh, it's a really cool show. And Linda is my favorite character because um, uh, she like she is like so she's sometimes independent, sometimes that she needs help from her husband Bob. I kind of don't like Bob. I kind of like him. He's like always a jerk to like. Uh, some like some people, and um, but he's just a really funny guy. <laughs> like <laughs> the way how like the way how he screams, it like it doesn't really it doesn't really crack. It just stays at the same tone of his scream. So uh, and he says, "Oh my god!" Uh, like all of his episodes, like almost every time he says that. But he can some he can like a lot of times go like oh god. What I think of Gene, he's a goofball, troublemaker, and he's a savant. I don't know what that means, but <laughs> well, <laughs> he is like so Gene. Uh, he also um, likes to play with his keyboard, goof around all the time. Uh, burgers. He wears a burger suit. Like he did in the first episode of Bob's Burgers, where he like served like little tiny burgers, and he has this uh, horn, like kind of like uh, reminds of everybody from the Minions. Uh, <laughs> I can't really do it. Pew pew pew, and it also has that laser, all the other sounds and stuff. Um, there's also an app where you can play with Gene's keyboard, but it got like uh, a bad review. Is a two out of five because. A lot of people said that there was no fart sound to the app, so, uh, uh, yeah, that's, that's, that's terrible, so, uh, but I love, but I love, uh, Gene's voice in that show, and, um, I'll tell you who, I'll tell you who all their, I'll tell you who the characters are voiced, uh, later on, um, and Louise, Louise is evil, dark, and annoying, so, <laughs> Louise is always on the dark side, and sometimes she's nice, and, um, and, like, <laughs> well, <laughs> Louise wears a bunny hat, a green dress, I guess it's a green dress, and black woman shoes, yeah. There was only one episode, there was only one episode, uh, the first, I think it was the first episode of season three where her hat gets taken away by Logan. Which the which is the character I don't like so uh, yeah because <laughs> I don't like villains and um the <laughs> and uh, what else uh, Louise has a great laugh a great voice um, and uh, and she's just really cute in that show 
And when I think about Teddy, uh, who is a customer to Bob's Burgers, not a family member, uh, he has like a very, very great iconic voice on the show, and um, he has a hat, which he's like bald, and um, and the <laughs> and the way how he screamed in the season four Christmas episode. Uh, <laughs> it was, it's really funny, he, like, shake his head and he moves around it, and after he, after his wrist gets caught in a Christmas wrist in the refrigerator, that one was really funny. <laughs> now, who are they voiced by? I'm gonna start off with the main character of the show. Bob Belcher is voiced by H. John Benjamin. Linda Belcher is voiced by John Roberts. Tina Belcher is voiced by Dan Mintz. Gene Belcher is voiced by Eugene Merman. Louise Belcher is voiced by Kristen Shaw, who just recently done Toy Story 4. Still in theaters now, guys. You guys can go watch it. Teddy is voiced by Larry Murphy. H. John Benjamin did Archer. Still doing Archer, guys. He's like... Like, in 2009, he started Archer before Bob's Burgers in 2011, so... It's really cool. John Roberts, uh, before Bob's Burgers... He makes, like, uh, YouTube videos of mocking his own mother. I, like, watch them, and it, it, they're super funny. <laughs> it's like, why isn't the tray on? Come on, turn on the tree, please. Film mommy. Turn on the tree. And pick up all that shit. <laughs> it's really funny. <laughs> and Dan Mintz uh, uh, did, like, stand-up, and he had his first writing job uh, for Crank Yankers. Let's see. Um, and, like... His stand-up is, like, so amazing. He hasn't done stand-up in a while. He says he said that he still gets stage fright uh, from that. And and uh, there's, like, um, there's like a lot of high-energy stand-ups. But Dan Mintz, though, he kind of, like, um, doesn't move a lot in his stand-ups. That's why he don't... That's, he doesn't move in his uh, stand-up comics. And, uh, well, that's that's what I like about him. Just to, just, like, not move when you're doing his stand-up. And, uh... Uh, he says he's a really cool guy, and he has a very great voice as well. And he still he 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 does uh, talk like Tina uh, in real life, so he's a uh, he's a really awesome guy. Eugene Merman also used to do stand up, and uh, he I think he did some other shows. I kind of don't remember. Well, he did stand up before Bob's Burgers as well, um, and uh, he's like he uh, and he did some other shows, which I. Christian Shaw uh, used to do, like, some uh, movies. He did uh, Toy Story 3. He did the... She, wait. She did Toy Story 3. She did the Muppets. Uh, kind of the Muppets. Or, yeah, the Muppets. And, um... I can't remember the rest, so the, you guys are going to have to... Read. And she did a show called uh, The Last Man on Earth, uh, which is a show that I haven't seen. I think I'll have to just watch that. And, um, uh, Larry Murphy, uh, is, yeah, we have to cut that out. <sighs> All right. <laughs> uh, one thing I like about Tina Belcher is that she moans. <laughs> one day. This will be a YouTube challenge uh, on here, and someone has to do it the longest time. There was actually one video where at, like, uh, I think it was at Comic-Con or something, uh, T Dan Mintz, who voices Tina Belcher, uh, did the longest, did, like, an, uh, challenge. <laughs> that was, that was pretty, that was pretty cool, man. Or should I say, that was pretty cool, Dan. There you go. <clears throat> If I would ever rate this show between 1 and 10, probably I'm going all out. 10 out of 10 on this show. Because uh, this uh, is one of the funniest shows I can binge watch every year. Because I just uh, binge watched this show like last week. I first like um, did the holiday collection, then I started off with 1, and then I ended uh, yesterday with 8. So, um... Uh, that was pretty fun, just binge watching shows all the time, like um, like CSI or The Vampire Diaries, uh, Supernatural, 
The Walking Dead, obviously it's dead right now, so, yeah, they're, they're all just, they're all just pretty fun shows to binge watch, so, um, I haven't seen those shows yet, but, you know, I don't like, I don't like dark shows, I like comedy ones like Bob's Burgers, there's also, there's also some other shows that are similar to Bob's Burgers, but they don't have to deal with the restaurant, um, actually they all don't have to deal with the restaurant, um, there was like Family Guy, The Simpsons, Futurama, American Dad, King of the Hill, and oh god, what was I supposed to say? Futurama, yes, Futurama. Uh, Futurama is a is a show that deals with space. So uh, I, yeah, there was like Fry, um, and I can't remember the rest of those Futurama uh, show Futurama characters. I haven't uh, I haven't seen Futurama in a while, so that's kind of the ones I missed. And The Simpsons. I do remember The Simpsons. Uh, I'm not like a very professional member. So you guys are going to have to forgive me if you guys have seen those shows. The Simpsons, yes, I love this show as well. It's like yellow people. Actually, those Bob's Burgers. Um, Bob Belcher made a cameo for The Simpsons, including Peter Griffin from Family Guy. And the entire family actually appeared on The Simpsons for one episode where they... Um, at their lips, like, kind of like this. <laughs> but in Bob's Burgers, they, they don't they don't have this. They don't have that. So, that one's actually really cool. They kind of like uh, duck mouths. Quack, quack. Quack, quack, quack. And, um, a uh, family guy. Oh, wait. The Simpsons. The Simpsons, we got Homer Simpson, his his wife, Marge Simpson, and, um, that one, uh, that, that, that one's really cool as well. American Dad is Stan Smith. I'm just gonna do the main characters. Um, <laughs> King of the Hill, I think it's Hank Hill, I don't know. Yeah, so I haven't seen... I, I actually miss King of the Hill a lot. I wish they can bring that show back, so, yeah. Alright, guys. Uh, that is gonna do it for this video. Um, um, let me know if you guys have seen Bob's Burgers. And also, let me know if you guys um, have those uh, DVDs as well. And um, and it's, uh, it's just a really cool show. And uh, uh, it's just a... Uh, <laughs> Um, a really awesome show to watch, and if you guys have seen the show and have those DVDs, um, one more thing about Bob's Burgers before I have to get the hell out of here. This show used to be on Netflix. I watched, I first, I first watched the show when it was on Netflix. It kind of, it like interested me to binge watch the show. It had four seasons. Then the fifth one came along. I binge watched that, and then it left on April first, which I thought it was an April Fool's joke, but then it turned out to be real. And now everyone's watching it on Hulu right now because, like, nobody watches TV anymore, okay? And I've heard that they're premiering a 10th season of the show, and I'm so excited for that. And they're also getting a movie, and, um, uh, it's still airs on Fox, guys. But nobody watches TV anymore, which I know of. Um, but everyone still watches Bob's Burgers on TV, and that's really cool. Alright, please give our video a like, comment, and subscribe, and hit that notification bell on the right. What if I post a video? And thank you all for watching. And as always, I'll see you tomorrow in your next video. Bye bye!